Hello guys, I'm back. Um, I'd love to say I'm glad to be back, but I'm not at all. Uh, Arsenal have begun the Premier League season in, well, classic fashion. Uh, if you were playing kind of Arsenal opening day bingo, you would have won big today. There were injuries, bits of calamitous defending, booze, chance for spending some money. Uh, really, we were ticking all the boxes today. It was a, a nightmare that unfolded. And at one stage, it was 4-1 to Liverpool at the Emirates Stadium. We put some respectability back on the scoreline by getting to 4-3, but uh, it still feels very, very despondent around the club. Everyone seems very down. I think that um, the real message of the day, the real lesson is, a, if you'll forgive the cliche, it's that that, that, that old fail to prepare, prepare to fail, a lack of preparation hurt uh, Arsenal today in every respect. For a start, this team isn't ready. It's not finished. More work should have been done in the transfer market. We're still shy of central defenders. We still need a centre forward. Um, had that been done by the campaign's kickoff, maybe we would have been in a better, well, we certainly would have been in a better position to get a good result today. Doesn't guarantee we would have done, but we would have had more chance. Uh, a lack of preparation affecting guys like Callum Chambers and Gold Holding. That's not their fault. They're inexperienced, but they're not prepared for this kind of encounter. They shouldn't be there. If Arsenal wants Godran Mustafi, why hasn't that deal been rushed through? Yes, we might save a few million quid by stringing it out, but what's the point? We don't, we've got that million quid. What we don't have is any points. We lost three of those today. I'd rather lose millions of pounds from a bank balance that really is very, very healthy than start losing many more points. And do you have to question the, the physical preparation of the players as well? Uh, you know, Arsene Wenger was asked about playing the likes of Koscielny, Giroud and Ozil next week against Leicester. Feels like we need them now. He said, well, the risk is if they're not prepared, they get hurt. Well, I've got news for you, Arsene. Aaron Ramsey got hurt today. Alex Iwobi got hurt today. Were these guys ready? A hamstring injury, a muscular strain in the first game of the season. What's going on there? Did he have enough rest? Was he right? I mean, they're huge question marks for a long time now over the physical fitness of some of these players. Um, Ramsey's thighs have been problematic, but that's quite staggering. All in all, a very difficult day. I mean, Liverpool can't really defend either, and they've got Mignolet in goal, which I think explains how we got three today. I mean, particularly on Chamberlain's, he should have done better. But to concede four at home, oof, and it could have been worse. Petr made a couple of saves. And when you look at it, he couldn't really have done much about the goals. It would be disappointing to be beaten from that distance on the free kick, but the others... Chambers and Holding, I mean, you don't want to crucify them. They're only young players, 20, 21, the pair of them, but they shouldn't be out there. And that's on the manager. And, you know, he can say, well, the window's still open, but the season's started now and we are dropping points. You know, if we end this season three points behind another team, then, you know, it still counts. All these points count pre the deadline. Arsenal should have been ready. Liverpool look ready. Liverpool look good. They've got a manager who's clearly very focused, who seems to have a plan, is enacting it, has invigorated the club, and it's hard not to be a bit jealous about that. Arsenal stumbling into this season. Um, very disappointing day in every respect. And, uh, yeah, I'm sat here in a performers bar at the Pleasance in Edinburgh. It's supposed to be swanky, instead it just feels like a sort of, I don't know, shit strip club. I spin the table around, look. I mean, it's, it's horrific. It's not doing much for my mood. Um, but yeah, and the next fixture, Leicester away, doesn't feel much better. So this is probably the last thing we needed. <laughs> uh, it's going to be an interesting, interesting few weeks until the deadline comes. Arsenal need to do something. Because if not, not only are they going to have a very difficult season where they're going to struggle to finish in the top four, but they're going to have a fan base who are Oof, ready to revolt. Okay, let's leave it there. Football's back, guys, and doesn't it feel good?